and welcome back to Western New York Living. I know it may feel like spring is far away, but coming up soon is an event that marks the beginning of a new season in Western New York. I am, of course, talking about the Hospice Spring Bouquet Sale. In 32 years, this sale has raised over six million dollars for Hospice Buffalo. Joining me now to tell us more about the Hospice Spring Bouquet Sale is Kathy McGovern and Tammy Berner. Girls, thanks so much for being here today. Nice thanks to be here. Me. So Kathy, the Hospice Spring Bouquet Sale, give me the details. Well, it, again, we're, we're here talking about it. Um, this bouquets will be on sale starting Wednesday through Saturday this week uh, at all the florists in Western New York and many of the public sites, most of the hospitals. Um, if you go to hospicespringbouquetsale.com, you can see a listing of everything, mm -hmm. of every place that will be selling them. It's amazing that this is hospice's largest fundraiser. It is. It's, it's wonderful that we raise so much money for hospice. Uh, we anticipate raising about $350,000. Okay. And as you mentioned, we've raised over $6 million in the 32 years that we've been doing this, which is wonderful. Um, the proceeds of the bouquet sale go to, uh, to provide care, comfort, and support for patients and the families of the patients. Right here in Western New York? Right here in, in Erie County. Oh, I love that. Now, Paula's Donuts has created yet another way to support Hospice Buffalo. I haven't technically confirmed this, but I think if you buy the Paula's Donuts for this, I don't think there's any calories in the donuts. No. No, no, that's Tell that's me about me. that. We all agree. <laughs> right. Uh-huh. So half the proceeds from the Polish Donuts go to hospice again this year. Uh -huh. And uh, as you can see, they're, they're the cannoli chocolate chip filled donuts. Amazing. And they are so good. And so <laughs> worth it. Tammy, your story about you and your daughter, Katie Jo. Tell me about your experience with hospice. Um, they were very um, good with her. They, I mean... She was in a lot of pain, so they helped in so many uh, forms, you know, mm -hmm. to help her um, ease her pain, and they helped not only her, but the whole entire family. And um, did you know about hospice before? Like, had you had any idea of what they really do? No. So no, what would I, you say to somebody who has never experienced hospice? That it's not what you think. Yeah. That it's um, to help prolong your life, not to, you know, not where a place where you go. Right. To end. Exactly. Now you're giving back to hospice by becoming the first ever pre-sale site for the hospice spring bouquet sale. How are you giving back? Tell me. Just collecting as much um, as much as I can in you know uh, flower sales and for my the memory of my daughter. Mm -hmm. I'm just. How are you doing so far? Um, I raised three thousand and forty dollars. Wow, that's amazing. Good for you. And t let's talk a little bit about about the flowers, Kathy, because th is this what the bouquet looks like? This is a sample of what the bouquets will look like. It's a 10 stem bouquet and the flowers come in. We have, um, it, even as we're talking, the uh, volunteers are getting together in a very cold warehouse in Chictawaga <laughs> where they're assembling the 30,000 uh, 30, bouquets that will uh -huh. be distributed throughout the area. You know, Tammy, anytime I talk to somebody who's willing to come on the show and share a story about somebody that they've lost. Tell me something great when you think about your daughter. Give me one of her stories. Uh, she just she loved life. She loved people, and she she would you know she would have done the same thing had it been me. Mm -hmm. So, I I mean she just loves to help out, and I'm doing this. I and I know she's right there with me, Good. pushing me to do it. Of course she is. Thanks for sharing your story. I appreciate Thank it. You. Good luck. Oh my gosh, <laughs> here it is. The 33rd annual Hospice Spring Bouquet Sale taking place March 6th through the 9th. Bouquets will be available throughout Erie County, including Key Bank branches, participating florists. Paula's Donuts and many hospitals and public buildings. Remember, Paula's Donuts will be selling their special cannoli donut for sale with some of the proceeds benefiting hospice. For more information, call 686-8090 or visit their website at hospicespringbouquetsale.com. Well, that's a wrap for our show for this Saturday morning. Thank you so much for tuning in. Remember, you can catch Western New York Living again every Monday morning, 1130. We bring you an entirely new show filled with wonderful guests. Enjoy the rest of your weekend. Stay warm. We'll see you soon. Special consideration for today's show paid for by the following.